all hearts and minds clear, y'all. My feelings was really, really crud. What's up, Kirby Cutie? It's your very real size beauty. It's Marie. And y'all, so today is gonna be a little different type of video. Um, I gotta get ready to go do errands, take me and Champ to the doctor's office. But um, it's a lot of things that's been on my heart, my mind, my chest, and my body that I wanted to talk to y'all about and just like bring y'all in on like my feelings and things that I be trying to do behind the scenes that I think you guys should start knowing what I'm doing. That way, when shit comes out, or when she is the fan, it's like, oh, okay, well we knew Marie was already doing that. We knew what the fuck was going on, right? So, um, first things first, let's go ahead and find what we gonna wear today. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Y'all, my closet is a whole headache. Like a whole fucking headache. A whole headache. Out, I'm recording and I'm about to get dressed, so I need you out my room. I'ma just put it out there, y'all. Y'all seen the show, Big Girls with Lizzo, right? What's up, y'all? It's Lizzo. I'm looking for dancers. But what you didn't know is, I auditioned. I auditioned. Now, before I get into the details, let me go get my outfit together. Be right back in you. I'm going to go ahead and put my lashes on and tell y'all the story. So, yes, I applied for Lizzo's show. When I seen the casting for it, I was like, okay, cool. Like, this is going to be my big break. This is going to be, like, what puts the girl on the top. What really, like, make me be that it girl for real, for real, you know? Like, I know I'm the shit, but working with Lizzo and traveling with Lizzo and really making money like Lizzo will let y'all know I'm the shit. You feel what I'm saying? So, it was just like, okay, okay, okay. Excited. Her back, right? Her back. They asked y'all girl, they brought y'all girl to part two of the audition. Part two of the audition. So my question was good enough for y'all to want to know more about me. Cricket. Nothing. And y'all know me, I'm like, okay, I ain't heard back yet. So they, they still going through applications. They still, you know, I'm away. I'm away for my turn. No email. No nothing. Here's where it got hurtful for me. Boom. The show's dropping in literally like two to three days. How the show dropping and I ain't never filmed? <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to show out and I ain't on it. I'm trying to understand. Maybe I missed something. Can y'all help me help me understand? What the fuck happened? Okay. So, of course, I was like, fuck the show, I'm not watching the show. Nah, I ain't on it, I ain't doing it, I ain't doing it, blah, 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 blah. in my feelings, right? Because how you pass up Marie, shit happens. So then I was like, you know what, bitch, put your pride to the side. Clearly you didn't make season one, but guess what? They probably gonna have a season two or season three. Of course, because I'm in social media, I was hearing so much about the show. Oh, the show's dope, da 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 so I'm like, you know what, bitch, put your pride to the side. Let's look and see what they doing so that we can see what we need to do to do it better and make it for season two. You know, my favorite number three, so possibly season three. Okay? Still ain't watched the show yet, y'all. I've been watching Bits and Pieces, but I ain't gonna count. I be in my feelings so bad, like, ugh, this who y'all chose. <laughs> Boom, so that's just on. All right, so... Just looking back on my content, it's like, it really doesn't showcase me as a dancer. You know, somebody that's really out there learning choreo, teaching choreo classes, whatever the case may be. So it got me thinking of other ways of doing content and now I need to narrow focus on what it is exactly that I wanna do with my career in social media. So, all hearts and minds clear, y'all. My feelings was really, really crushed. Like, my feelings was fucking... I was... Y'all, still is. Like, we're not gonna sugarcoat it like, oh, I'm good, I bounced back. No, I haven't watched the show yet. 
<laughs> because my feelings are still hurt. But like I said, in order for me to learn and to do better, I got to see where I went wrong. So, um, watching my, uh, videos, even like when I posted on social media, cause she did tell us like, oh, post why we should pick you and things like that. If you scroll all the way back, I'll probably even insert a clip right here so you can see it. Dad, I'm the best web for you, but I go by this morning. I am from Newark, Delaware, but I reside or live in Atlanta, Georgia area. I am 26 years But it's cool. It's cool. Because best believe when I make it, when I get there, y'all remember saying me cheap. I'm going to be out there like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to be fucking it up. Fucking it up. <laughs> but yeah, so. I told y'all I was gonna bring y'all in. I'm bringing y'all in. So if you see me on Instagram, tag Lizzo. Um, I am doing more choreography type of TikToks. And I'm also looking into getting into choreography classes and just perfecting what I'm doing. Like, if I really wanna do it, let's do it all the way. So, yeah, y'all, like, I'm finna finish getting dressed. Like, it's just, it's. You only gonna be able to do what you can when you put yourself out there and really say you're gonna do it. And I never knew that Lizzo would do a show like this. Um, and even when I auditioned, it said they were looking for dancers, singers, and all types of stuff. So I really didn't know what I was embarking on. Um, and you know, when you're trying out for stuff, you try to wanna be what they're looking for versus be yourself. And I think that's where I went wrong at. Like, I was so big on, well, what does she need? Just tell me what you need and I can do that. You know? Like, Lizzo, what you want? Just tell me, girl. Just tell me. I'll make it happen. But that's not, that wasn't it. I should have been showcasing my personality. I should have been being Marie. Like, I'm not afraid of the camera. Oh, she told me not to use this hair and this. She think I'm nappy. Um, you know, I'm not afraid of the camera. This is not nothing that would have been out the norm for me, but I didn't showcase that. You know, like if they went to all my content, you couldn't see it. I know one of my biggest things is consistency. We're working on that this year as well. Like um, accountability and just, if you say you're gonna do something, do it. Like that's really what it comes down to. That's really what it boils down to. Y'all, this is Vegas here, I'm gonna go to Vegas. So, yeah, I just wanted to bring y'all in, let y'all know, like, your girl did it. I tried out. I didn't make it, but it's not going to stop She It's not going to change She, And we're going to keep doing us, y'all. We're going to keep making this content. We're going to keep letting people see us because best believe they see us. They might not want to say they see us, but they see us. Everybody fucks up, you know, everybody stumbles. And um, it just is what it is. Like, it just is what it is. I have so much positivity going on in my life. So much upcoming. Like, it hurts my feelings. But when I'm on a plane, I'm probably going to download the season and watch it. And just study. And use that as my template. It was a reason why I didn't make season one. Not to be funny or throw no shade. Because that's not how I move. But, you know, season one is always a trial error. They got to see how it works. They got to see how the views go. They got to see all types of stuff. So maybe that wasn't for me, you know? Maybe there's other opportunities out there. So yes, I love to entertain, I love to dance. Who better not to learn it from than the only and the best plus size <laughs> entertainer in the motherfucking world. Like it's Lizzo, bitch. <laughs> it's Lizzo, bitch. So yeah, like of course I would love the opportunity and when my time come, my time come. But until then, y'all, we finna be on this journey. On this journey, on this journey, on this journey, on this journey. And I, like I said, I got so much stuff in store for y'all. So stay tuned. We are dropping every Sunday. We're not missing a motherfucking Sunday. Um, by the time y'all see this, I'll probably already be in Vegas or already went to Vegas. But I got Vegas coming up. So stay tuned for that content. Um... My last cheer competition as well. Stay tuned for that. I'm doing my first pop-up shop this Sunday. Stay tuned for that. Like, it's just 
so much going on. It's a whole lot of, whole lot of, whole lot of. And you're not going to want to miss it. So make sure you follow the kid on all social media. Bigo at It's Marie. YouTube at It's Marie. Subscribe. Instagram can hit 100K on that ass at It's Marie. If it ain't added, it ain't true. <laughs> So yes, baby. I love you, Kirby Cutie. Don't forget to stay curvy. Because if you don't, who will? Follow the kid on all social media so you never miss content. And I love y'all and welcome to my life. Like, it actually feels really, really good. Like I usually come to y'all with, with bad news before. But I think because this is a little bit more publicly humili uh, hum humiliating. I was a little scared to tell y'all. Because to tell y'all about my mama issues, it was like, oh, that's between us. But, and I was just bringing y'all in on like what was going on. But for me to visually see a show that I did not make. And y'all, what the crazy part is, this ain't the first show I auditioned for and didn't make. This is not the first show, y'all. This is not the first show. So if y'all would like to know that story time, let me know in the comment box down below. I love you, Kirby Cutie. Don't forget to stay Kirby and stay cute because if you don't, who will? Love you. Peace.